you on this really exciting day. I want to thank uh, Secretary Salazar for, for visiting us and for visiting this beautiful area of our state. I want to recognize uh, Senator Reid because it was Senator Reid uh, who really um, played a leadership role in 2006 that laid the groundwork for the special resource study that makes the recommendation. So I want to thank Senator Reid for his leadership. Uh, thank Senator Whitehouse for his um, advocacy and his commitment to continue to, to push for this. And I know uh, I can count on my colleague in the House, uh, Congressman Langevin, to do the same. Uh, when the final report is transmitted to Congress, I look forward uh, to introducing the legislation that will create the John H. Chafee Blackstone River Valley National Historical Park in the House. Um, and uh, I think as the uh, the mayors have been recognized, but I want to just say that Mayor McKee, Mayor Grebian, and Administrator Hamilton, as leaders of low government, recognize the value of this uh, national park and the, the, the importance it has, the important impact it has on the local economy. As Secretary Salazar said this morning, uh, tourism is the fifth largest sector of our national economy. So this also means jobs, not only in the rehabilitation and planning of the national park, but obviously in the staffing and operation of the park after its establishment. So this is important because it, it, it memorializes a really important part of the history of our state, of our two states, but also an important part of the history of our country but also has huge environmental value and huge value in terms of promoting additional tourism and jobs in our state. So I'm committed to working as hard as I've ever worked to make sure that this happens on the House side and thank all of the partners who are around today who have been stewards of this area and of this effort for many, many years. Thank you for your good work. And I want to end by recognizing Bob Bendick, who I think was the first person to recognize long ago that the best way to ensure that this history was preserved was to establish a relationship with the National Park Service. So thank you for your visionary early teaching.